Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. This is Miles Luigi. Wait, wait, wait that's right. I'm nobody, no, void, nothing, nada, with Vivian, one of my enemies, following me. Alright, so I could just run off and continue on with the game, but why when I can listen on to gossiping, gossiping little birds? Love that message. 100 meg fat pipe. Mm, yeah, my local network is full of gigabit Ethernet fat pipes, but unfortunately, my internet 20 megabit per second fat pipes, which in the United States is actually pretty fast, and also costs a lot too. Um, besides the fat pipes, this is the one we want to listen to. Famous people are screwed. No one knows my name, I can use Unstoppable Magic. Therefore, if I'm famous, I am screwed. I can't use any magic because everyone knows my name. Ah, sucks to be Mario. And looks like we're gonna get ambushed again. Alright, you non-celebrity scrub, I'm gonna guess your name this time. Um, I'm gonna guess your name is Pop-Tart. Oh, what the f- What happened to the P? If I had a counter showing how many times I tried to sequence break this game, this would be plus one. I might just go back and count every single time I've tried. But yes, as a means to prevent you from just guessing the name outright, because I do happen to know what it is, they left out the P, so instead of me guessing Pop-Tart, I'm guessing Po-Tart. Lovely. No, I did try attacking him with something else. Perhaps maybe Vivian can land a hit on this guy? No, she can't. for another round of advanced enemy dodging. Let's see how well I can do this. This is a whole lot easier with Madden before, but I'm going to try to go draw the crazy daisy down near the bottom bush and then, come on, try. there you go. Then run over here, come on, get in there, ah! All right, whatever. Burn! 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 <laughs> okay, so my S rank went into an A rank on dodging enemies. All right. Hopefully the next one, since I don't have to get into a little sliver in the brush or bush, I can get this one just fine. There we go. Run above. Yay! Run away. Same strategy for this one. Ah! There we go. 
So a creature in the basement, the Creepy Steeple, happens to know the Duplagos name. Well, I could try running around Creepy Steeple if Vivian doesn't give me any real abilities inside the steeple over there to get anywhere new, but I haven't really explored this well too much. Inside we can see Buzzy Beetles. Oh, lovely. Of course, he would strike first. Or then my recommendation is to throw on both your flower savers so you can gratuitously use Quake Hammer all you want. Obviously for this battle, Quake Hammer is not going to do anything for me, but you'll see shortly why it's a wise idea to do that. And unfortunately, Vivian can't uh, put on headgear and... <laughs> Bring out a book quite like Goombella can. I'll get these tattles later. Holy crud! You stand here, they can't attack you. Which means you can, at free will, just go bonk at them all. From back there, nice and safely. Reward you get for not just running into the room all ramble. Remember when I said put on Quake Hammer? This is why. There are spiked Buzzy Beetles in here, and you can't jump on them. Don't quite have what we need to jump on them. Holy crud! <laughs> I just picked up a badge! Awesome! Too bad I just went right into another battle, but we're definitely going to be showcasing that as soon as possible. Wow, that's nice. <laughs> Alright, just a side note, even though I think Vivian is really awesome in that she burns everything to death, if you do attack a frozen enemy with Vivian, they unfortunately become unfrozen naturally. Well, normally doesn't help if the enemy's, you know, gonna die from the attack, though. Alright, let's take a look. Yay, look at that. We got a second power jump for nothing at all. No, I get a second charge badge. Whatever, I'm not gonna complain at getting a free badge. Hey, wait, did I just get another badge? Holy crud, I did! <laughs> These guys are just dropping badges all to Kaplooey! Another shrink stomp! Um, I'm a lucky son of a gun! And a power punch. I probably should have stored some items when I was in town. That would have been useful. Anyway, this is the badge we're supposed to get, which is Tornado Jump. Um. I don't really see a whole lot of people calling this a really useful badge, and rightfully so. The biggest reason why is, well, you jump on an enemy with Tornado Jump, and then you do this, like, tornado move where Mario spins around all happy-dappy. That attack where Mario hits all mid-air enemies with that tornado does two damage. Nevertheless, your attack power. It could actually work in your benefit if you have, uh, damage or attack power decreasing attacks, and your jump is pathetic, and then you do Tornado Jump. He's like, I did two damage, even though my jump did nothing. But otherwise, it's um, not a badge I really consider too terribly useful. Somebody please prove me wrong and tell me that Tornado Jump has some really good uses. It has a really cool, stylish move, I can say that. But, uh... There's a star piece right there.
This is the room we couldn't get in before because it was locked. Oh no, we're locked in here? But look at all these goodies, look at this. Oh my goodness gracious, this is a good badge episode. Holy crap, power plus just out of a treasure chest. So now I can make Mario and my partner outrageously deadly. In here, a Mr. Softener that I can't carry. I'm gonna leave that in here. Would you look at that? Strange treasure test. Last time I opened one of these, booze came out. I'm not sure if I want to open these or not. What's in here? A key? Not bad. What's in here? The letter P! The letter P. I opened the treasure chest and found a letter P inside. For Christmas, I'm going to give my uh, friends and family letter P's. So if they ever get cursed, they can uncurse themselves pretty easily. Duplice's name was highlighted in red. <laughs> in case you missed it, this is it. His name is Duplice. And you know what? Now that's exposed, I can say it all I want. Duplice, 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 Duplice. Let's let's go teach him a lesson on the next episode of Let's Play Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. Hopefully, I can get a lot more badge luck because this was a great episode, I must say. And if anybody has any roots for Tornado Jump, please tell me. <laughs> this has been Miles Luigi.